bricks, we bricks, we bricks, relax, we bricks, we bricks, relax, have a wax, relax, will you? Hello, FOX. Today we're doing bag 20, uh, which is the ninja control room. Thank you. Right, let's get at it. Another person. So we have a mini fig today, and I'm just oh yes, okay. I was wondering whether this was another uh, non mini fig mini fig. You know what I mean by that. But uh, this is Zane, uh, who seems to have a robot head. Um, oh, hang on, wait. I've done it again. He gets one of these. Fabulousnesses. On goes the head. On goes the fabulous ninja helmet. And uh, he gets a fulsome blade across his back. Anyway, there we are. There's Zane. Zane, I'm popping him up. I'm popping him up by the Zen Garden. I'll show you. There, look, he's, he's in situ. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Right, we're now making the ninja zone uh, today. And I do believe we commence with the Twitter eyes, which I will any second now. Right, let's have you Twitter eyes. Who are we starting with today? Uh, Never ending boy, Gary Blair, Gary Blair, Gary Blair, never ending boy, Gary Blair, Gary Blair, Gary Blair, says Eek, it's a mascara down at the diner, hashtag where's knuckles, hashtag yes I said mascara, hashtag shenanigans, hashtag beetle. Juice. Oh, hell in a handcart. Right, okay. Hell in a hand. Ah! Right. right, okay. Uh, let's be methodical. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Baby. No. I mean, it's hard to know whether this is sort of. This is shenanigans, or whether it, it's just a sort of multiple death matches going on. Jackie Swan. Sorry, you can't. Oh, oh, crumbs, I've just seen a fingerprint, which will be annoying uh, for some people. Oh, now then. If you please. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That's, that's a work of genius. Uh, Gary Blair, that's a work of genius. Uh, bring, 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 hello, uh, relax with bricks, just having a sub of coffee. Uh, yes, hello, uh, it's Katie Hall. Oh, hello, Katie Hall. Hello, um, are you phoning to complain? N no, I'm, I'm phoning to say, O-M-F-G, Gary, you are amazing, you need to take to make a coffee table book of these for Averwax, uh, like Where's Wally? I mean, I don't disagree. I don't disagree. I think they, they have been an absolute triumph, uh, Gary Blair. And you should be very, 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 very uh, proud of yourself for creating them. They're, they're, honestly, they're so inventive, aren't they? They've been absolutely brilliant. I cannot, I cannot heap enough praise upon the shoulders of the never-ending boinger. I can't, I just can't. I can't, it's not, it's not even possible. It's not even possible. 
It's not humanly possible. Now then, why am I doing that? I haven't even finished doing it. I haven't paid attention here. <sighs> I haven't even remotely paid enough attention to what I'm doing here. None. I was just carried away then. Hang on, there's even more going on here. Lord above. Hang on. Oh, I see. Right. Okay. Now I've got, now I've got the measure of it. Right. Okay. Fine. Okay. Fine. Um, I'm making four of these. I think I've said that already. Um, professor Langer. Uh, little Sue managed to become a professor of fish and fish-related matters and didn't adopt the title. Wait for it. Professor Poisson. Surely that can be no other. Uh, little Sue. As she's called Little Sue. She's little, as she's called Sue. She's little Sue. Um, I, I'm afraid I wish to make an objection. Oh, okay. Yep. 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 I'm, uh, I'm not sure I like this uh, suggestion, Emma. Yes. A professor of birds or a professor of plants. Yes. Professor of fish. Uh, I'm afraid uh, not so much. No, I, I'm afraid I'm against it, Emma. I'm very much against it, and I would like that to reflect it in the official club minutes. Yes, all right, yes. Uh, how's about... Um, hang on, though. Can I just check with you? Have you actually been to Codford University and taken a degree in recognising fish? Have, is, has that actually happened? I, I can name fish. I can name, I can name some fishers. Well, right, okay, all right. Uh, let me test you. Um, can you please name me three three fishes? I just want the name of three fishes. Uh, well, obviously, I need a drum roll. Obviously, no, it goes without saying. Uh, fingers, sticks, and paste. Thank you, press the button. S sorry. Sorry. Fingers, sticks and paste? Yes, fish, fingers, fish, sticks and fish paste. I've, name, I've named three fishes. Thank you, press the button. I think I would be very happy, actually, with, with the title Inspector of Fishes. Um, I, 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 have, as, I think I have well established now that... I have excellent observational skills and I'm very good at inspecting things. So uh, I think I will have inspector of fishes, please. Emma, thank you. Respect my fishing authority. Uh, press the button. Yeah, all right. She shall forth be known as the inspector. Uh, not, not. No, it's just just one of the other the other strings to her her very fulsome bow. Uh, she's of course uh, the the proprietor of the uh, Little Sue's Cafe. Yes, I'm very much proprietor of the Little Sue's Cafe with my puzzle puzzle and my sausage. Yes, but I'm also very capable when it comes to my duties as the inspector of fishes. Yes, all right. Yep. Okay. Fine. Professor Langow, in my defence, I'm only suggesting an alternative title to the one that was already being bestowed upon you. But if you think Professor Poisson is terrible, then I'm definitely at fault. Mm. Yeah, well, I think Inspector of Fishes is, is pretty good. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. We'll wait and see what little Sue says. But uh, Inspector of Fishes is pretty super. Um... Eight of these. Oh, okay. All right, one, two, three, four. A five, six, seven, eight. And I do believe it's all of those. Right, thank you. Um, Eric. He's got a duck of Fazio. They both like watching Lego. And they really like musicals. So his name is Eric. F -f -f -fum, et cetera. Uh, as to the poisson croissant request on live and bricking, it could always be a fish finger in a croissant. That would count and would probably not be too bad. Well, yes, um, yes, 
Yes. Ooh, oh dear, I do hope I do remember. I mean, what do you think the likelihoods of, of me remembering to have that organised in time for the next live and bricking? It's pretty much next to nil. Uh, but we'll give it a go. I'll try and remember. Uh, Stan's mum. Uh, little Sue is in esteemed company. My uncle was professor of pigeons at Yale University. He spent decades researching vision and eye movements of the flying vermin. So welcome to the world of scientific research, Little Sue. Photo, pigeon professor, Uncle Pat. Oh, we love the look of him. Oh, let's give him a round of applause. Uncle Pat, pigeon professor. He sounds fabulous. Uncle Pat, pigeon professor. Uncle Pat, Uncle Pat, Uncle Pat, Uncle Pat. Uh, Professor Lego, it's bricks and pieces. Bricks and pieces, 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 bricks and pieces. A fada da da, a fada da, a da da da. Thank you. Take it away, Prof. Oh, hang on. Hang on, Prof. I think we've got a piece we've never had before. Now, we've had pieces like this, but have we had this specific piece? <gasps> Gosh, have we ever started a Bricks and Pieces with a piece that might be in Bricks and Pieces? I don't think we have. Take it away, uh, Professor Lego. Uh, <clears throat> it's a short Bricks and Pieces today with just the one new element. But it's an unusual one, to say the least. Let's look at roof tile, 8 times 6, 45 degrees with cat. Ah, uh, this one. This one, yes, it's this one. Yep, okay, take it away. This odd piece has appeared in 14 sets since its introduction in 2016, but despite the infrequent usage, has managed to notch up being released in six different colours. Its strongest association is with the Nexo Knights, a theme that spanned 2016 to 2018 and saw 107 products released in that time. Given the sets it has been used in since Mother Goose started up Relax with Brooks, it isn't surprising she hasn't come across it until now. One of the sets Mother Goose didn't look at was the 2019 reissue of Elsa's Magical Ice Palace. The piece appeared in Aqua. Why do I bring this up? It was while reviewing the sets that I discovered the existence of snow geese. What? Snow geese. On the left, an official image of what a snow gay looks like. On the right, the Lego snow gay. That's something unsettling about the Lego version, and I can't turn my gaze away. Snow geese. Snow geese. Snow geese. Back on topic. So that's the roof tile 8x6, 45 degrees with cat. A specialised piece that gets used sporadically and which I'm struggling to make innuendos about. Maybe I'll just say shaft as a shaft. The best I've come up with so far is look at the tip on that. I said tip. Thank you. Where's a black sausage when you need one? I said black sausage. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Eric. Uh, Professor Petit Poisson LSU, can you please tell us about the clownfish? Um, uh, um, there's a drum roll in my work. Yes, uh, the, the, the clownfish, uh, is a fish which, um, is a clown. Thank you, press the button. Well done, yes. Very good. Thank you for that. Yes. Thank you for that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for that. Oh, I do hope this continues. Um, <laughs> um, Baby Smacks in the Sensei. Uncle Strawberry. The Morning Money, the Matter, the Little Whispery. <laughs> Says, uh, time for another controversial opinion. And uh, please cover Brian the Doodah's ears if he has any, but I do not like that teal. What on earth are you talking about, Bevis? 
Not a colour I like at the best of times, but there's just too much on this set for my tastes. With regards to the vague criticism of this set, it feels slightly like Lego knew that people would love it because it's a continuation of City and Docks. But it's just missing the little extras like the jokes and the stories uh, of the other two. City has moving parts like the crab oven and the sushi conveyor belt, but even Docks has the chicken rotisserie. Oh, yes, the chicken rotisserie was amazing. And the fruit boxes that uh, tip up an actual secret rooms and hidden pieces. Gardens is a great build, but it's just missing the finishing touches. I assume the blue ninja suit would be in the hidden room. The two jumper plates in the middle look right for a minifig uh, to fit on it. Oh, that's... Mm, yes, that's a good point. I will move them in there. But yes, a hidden room with the great big windows in it is not a hidden room in any way, shape or form. Thinking about it, he adds some more. The lack of story is possibly the biggest thing missing from this set. I completely agree with you. Even without the RWB editions, City and Docks and the likes of the Brick Bank and Detective Agency have so much story built into the design that the lack of it here is noticeable. Oh, and with regards to the colours, it's not a colour blindness issue. It's the more muted shades of green and orange I have issues with, which is why I tend to use much brighter colour in my art. It's just in this set, there's a bit too much colour. There are lots of reds and oranges and bright blues and yellows in City and Docks, but they're the accent colours. The majority of the sets are brown, black and white and muted shades that make the signs and the lanterns really stand out against them. Thank you, Bevis. Thank you. It was a fulsome, a fulsome review. A fulsome review. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. Now let's get this right, Kennedy. Don't get, don't muck it up. Don't muck this up. Ooh. Oh, that's wrong. Thank you. Wrong. Wrong. Correct. Oh, this is tricky because it's different at each corner. Just concentrate. I'm just concentrating. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. While I concentrate. No, that's wrong. That's correct. And then, oh, that's weird. That, oh, no, it's not. It's that. And then that goes there. Right. Okay. I think I've done that right now. Okay. Ruth Hayes. Uh, no, sorry. Little Sue. Emma. Yes. I'd like to discuss uh, the lack of exciting uh, moving parts, please. Uh, yes, please, please continue. Well, uh, we mustn't forget our more, uh, the, uh, we mustn't forget the arcade machine, which of course uh, I keep wanting to call a vending machine for obvious reasons. You may, you may boing now. Thank you. Yes. Uh, but I, I wanted to say that I think it's particularly clever. And could it be that Ninjago City was all new and exciting, so it was loved that little uh, bit more? These, these are my thoughts. Thank you, Buzzer Button. Um, I think there might be a, a lot in that, yes, but I also I also do agree with Bevis vis-a-vis, -vis, you know, nothing beats the crab oven, uh, the sushi bar, and also the brilliant story that we were able to, to, to enjoy from start to finish uh, with Ninjago City. And I, I, I do think one of the biggest failings of this set is, is that there's... There's been no stories about the um, the characters we're putting on, which which we so enjoy, don't we? Uh, Ruth Hayes, a good point, little Sue. I think I'm going to watch Ninjago City again. Uh, Bevis, I think there is a bit of that. City was so different from anything that had been done by Lego before. And one of the first RWB builds that anything that's following it and playing on the same themes, especially a third time, is going to be not quite as good. It's like a good film threequel that has everything that makes the original work so well, but doesn't quite bring something new to make it its own thing, rather than an enjoyable retread of something great. Mm. Now, I think that's fair. We'll give us an applause, a round of applause. I think it's entirely fair. Now then, what am I doing here? Oh, I see, this. Thank 
you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, hashtag where's knuckles? A solution to yesterday's where's no short knuckles? Hashtag blurry is all blurry. Well, will you look at that, please? Look. I mean, on a fiendish, absolutely fiendish. His name is Rio, and he really likes Lego, and he really likes other things that rhyme with Lego. This huge bagger, bagger, biggy, big, big. This he hard one, Boeing. No wonder I couldn't find it. Nice hiding. Hmm. <laughs> nice hiding, uh, little Sue. Uh, Emma. Yes. I just wanted to say that the hidden room looks a little bit like a de Blair hole. And I wonder if the ninja mannequin oh, is supposed to go inside it. Maybe you could put it inside it now, please. Yes, all right then. I will do this for you. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on, please. I'm going to have to go in a little. Sorry if you've got a... a, a Oh, oh, I've just take, I've taken it off. Look, oh, I've taken it off. I tell you what, I'll just show you me doing it down here. Makes it easier, doesn't it? And then there won't be complaints. What do you mean complaint? Oh no, might have to do this with with uh, with precise tweezers. Some crumbs alive. You see, again, I wish I wish they could tell you to do this earlier or it's in it's in in there look in that gives it more of a hidden room feel doesn't it uh right okay that's back on now thank you thank you thank you good good good, good suggestions one and all of course i've lost my place i don't know where i'm up to at all um emma yes I'm not finished discussing the hidden room. Yeah, all right, go on then. Could the room be hidden because you can't get inside that? Because it might be covered up a bit more by the next room up, which I think might be Ninja Control Room that, that we're building today, Emma. So it might be a bit more of a hidden room, Emma. That is actually fair. Yes, press the button. Okay, well done. I did a burp. I did a burp. Um, uh, Ruth Hay says, For its worth, I agree with much of what Bev has said in his thread. It's a fabulous build. Fabulous. But it's so far lacking the charm or humour of City and Docks. No obvious story either. I'm enjoying it, though. Looking forward to visiting the museum. Yes, I, th I, th I think we're mostly all a bit annoyed there's no story. Kath Pearson. Uh, everyone in the senior class of Ninja School was marked absent today. They all got... An A plus, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Tweedle, Mandy, Tweedle, Vos, Poo, Sue. They are twins and they love poo. Uh, Tweedle Mandy, Tweedle Mandy uh, says, here's the leaderboard on eight points and hanging on to her lead is Rosie. On seven, Mother Goose, Mike, Sharon and Eric. On six, Rio and Bev. On four, Faye. On three, Katie and Ruth. On two, Gillian B and Jackie. And on one point, Laura and Dolly Neptune. The next round will be worth... Two points. Oh my God. So thrilling. So thrilling, so thrilling. Um, uh, oh, this should have gone first. Sorry, uh, Aop Afflewax uh, says Tweedle Mandy. Here's the answer to the latest round of which Tweedle is which. Sue was with Auntie Joan, and I was with Grandad. The correct Afflewax were Mike, Bev, Rosie, Faye, Eric, Katie, Sharon, and Mother Goose. Get in. Well done. Uh, leaderboard next, which was actually before, thanks to Twitter and its usual nonsense. Uh, KC uh, Karen Karen KLC says, "What on earth?" is for ninjing jingwang it's it's um it's just a very special swear word uh that i'm afraid i can't tell you the meaning of thank you now uh, let's pull the curtain of discretion over that and take ourselves off to the twitter eyes twitter 
Rise to do be do be do twee do rise to do be do be do twee do rise to do be do be do twee do rise twee do rise to do be do be do twee do no Google eyes Google eyes to do be do be do Google eyes to do be do be do Google eyes to do be do be do Google eyes right that's enough Emma stop it uh, Rio dear a mother a pendle bre it's a small world. I used to live in Beddington on the border, between there and Wellington. I also worked at uh, Wellington High Street, a British Heart Foundation. Such a lovely area. Yeah, it is. It's a lovely area. Uh, Janet Pendlebury. Janet Pendlebury. Janet Pendlebury. Um, she says, I have a couple of China knickknacks bought from your shop on my shelf. Wonder if you were there uh, when I got them. Well, that's that's exciting, isn't it? Can you imagine? Can you imagine? I love things like that. I absolutely love things like that. Like that, that you've bumped into someone who then turns up later in life. I absolutely adore little stories like that. Pretty much love them. Well, it was, I, I had it with Georgia Gibbon. I went to see Alison at uh, a gig she was doing at Ronnie Scott's. And, uh, and at the end of it, this, this, this woman came up to the table and said, oh, would you like, Alison would like to see you now uh, back in the backstage area. This was after the, the gig, of course. And uh, that was Georgie Gibbon. And I was in a room with her for about an hour uh, at the same time. And uh, who would have known right there and then that we would be getting married five years later? Who would have guessed it? Um, mm, might have been three years later. Mm, don't know. Uh, Eric, uh, Jimin Jim Wang's more invented curse words, Mother Goose. I love it. I invent my own like uh, criminy crackers, frickin' frackin' firecrackers. That's a good one. <laughs> 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 oh, hello, Dolly Neptune. Yeah, well, you're my pit. Yeah, hello. Uh, I just want to say I do not believe that little Sue is a real fish professor. Uh, there, I've said it. Uh, she's hoodwinking Mother Goose. Uh, and all of us. I, I don't think she knows the bl blindest thing about fish. Um, and and there it is. Well, do, what do you... I challenge you, Dolly Neptune. I, I challenge you. I am going to uh, defend the honour of the Inspector of Fish, <laughs> Little Sue. I will defend her honour to the death. And she knew about fingers and sticks and paste, uh, all of which are fish. You absolute muppet. Can, can you like me? No, I can't because it's a dog. <laughs> Jordan, Jordan, Jordan. Jordan. I just like to say a thank you to everyone who reached out with messages of support. I've been reading them over and over, and I'm feeling much better now. I'm getting myself into a new routine and see if that helps. This is great news to hear, Jordan, and I'm very pleased uh, that you're on the mend. And uh, we're all here rooting for you uh, and waiting for when you feel uh, strong enough to return. And I, I, I will say it yet again. On behalf of all of us uh, at the Afawak gang, uh, we love you, Jordan, and we're here for you. And uh, any time you need us, you just let us know. Super. You can have a clap. You can have a clap. Uh, Eric, I had never heard the song The Magic Bus, so I had to look uh, up the Who's version. I think I like Gillian B's version better. I mean, who doesn't like the Gillian B version's better. Absolutely uh, nobody. Speaking of which, we thought she was from Canada and then we didn't think she was from Canada and then it turned out she was from Canada. It's Joe. Ooh. 
B. Professor de Poisson put his suet. It has a lovely, lovely ring to it. Well, she's in, in Le Inspector, La Inspector de Poisson. Now, La Inspector de Poisson. De Poisson. La Inspector de Poisson. And that concludes Le Business of Club. Um, exciting news. We have a. Um, This one and this one are in the wrong place. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Right, we've got a sticker. Sticker number 16. Sticker uh, number 16. Sticker number 16. Sticker number 16. Here we go. Sticker number 16. Mm, no, a little bit too. That's better. Sticker number 16. What's going in there? Voila, the little controlling area. <coughs> Right, this. This is a bit tricky. How does that work then? Oh, it must be like that. Thank you. Thank you. So, two of these. Absolutely hopeless at getting these things on. Absolutely useless. <coughs> Is that me? No. Absolutely flipping hope there, Dan. Oh, it's exhausting. It's exhausting. Right. on there. There's no access in here. There's absolutely no access point into this control room. That's interesting, isn't it? Slash borderline insane. Right. Then this goes on. Oh, it revolves. Okay, so we've got a revolving thing. Yep. Then. Ooh. Hang on. Right. This does strike me as a bit daft that there's no entry point into the control room unless something extraordinary is about to happen but that really genuinely is there's no entry point unless it's all done by computers yep then we're making four of these. Huh? 
Oh no, where's it gone? Oh no, I've, I've, a piece has been lost in, 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 in the, in the entrails of the Tweedle blanket, but I have found it and it fell on the floor, so we must. Yes, thank you, Emma. Yes. We must always stick to the rules, mustn't we? Yes, Emma. Yes. We like rules at, at Relax With Bricks, yes. Everyone loves a rule at Relax With Bricks, there's no doubt about that. Gosh, why didn't they? I would, have, I would have put those in first. Voila. Mm, this is rather nice. What's going in the middle? Let's get that in. Oh, we're getting some things out of the big bag. Thrilling. That's these. Do we think we've had these before? Yes, we did. We had them uh, for the sign that we've already had, didn't we? Yes. And gosh, and that's going on there. Oh, look, I mean, that's that's rather fabulous, isn't it? Still no access point, though. Do you know what? I've got a funny feeling we're about to finish the... Um, this part of the build, the main building. Because remember, we've got the island to come. Anyway, brace yourselves. This might be the end. Yeah, I think it is. Oh, I feel a bit sad. It's not the end end, though, of course, because... Um, hang on. We 
is it going in? up a bit. It's in there. And that goes on there. Let me come out so you can see that. Right. Yep. Then that oh, I see, I see. Um, whoops. That's a nice way of doing more satellites, isn't it? Mm -hmm. It's that way. I like that you can move those. Right, we're going on. We're going on. Um, we are going on. So that's going... Oh, it's a tight fit. Oh, it's not even fitting. How on earth? What? What? Don't say... Oh no. Oh, this is a disaster. This is an absolute disaster. The whole thing's on wrong. Oh, Emma Kennedy. Really? Hang on. Hang on. That's supposed to go in there. But ha is that in? Yes. Right. Now it's in. Okay. Right. Voila. Um, oh, no, we're not quite finished. Oh, no, we're not quite finished. There's something that's going in here. Uh, but anyway, there it is. Look, we've got that on. And I do believe we are... We're making the roof... We've got the rooftop zen garden to make. All right, so come back tomorrow. And I think we are definitely then finishing this part, this section, the main build uh, with the rooftop zone garden. So I will see you then. Uh, FOX forever. Bye-bye.